What to do, YouTube? It's your boy. Don't know our father. Yes, sir. I will stay back at it, but technically, this is the first time we are playing Hogwarts Legacy. Yes, sir. It, I've been waiting on this genuinely my whole life. I don't need a lot of y'all. RPG Harry Potter game. I mean, like, come on. Who wouldn't want that? So, I'm finna go ahead and jump into character creation. I ain't gonna lie, I have been, I'm a fan of the game, so. I have been looking, you know, at a lot of drops. I see people, especially in the black community, we like, they, they like the black customization. Me, me personally, I've seen it too, I actually like it too. But I ain't, <clears throat> so let's see how we gonna make our character. But how you guys doing, man? Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Um, I am gonna still do NCAA uh, gameplay. I don't want you guys who are my NCAA subscribers to think that, you know, it's just I'm just stopping. But I honestly, quite frankly, want to play more games than just NCAA. You know, I don't want to be an NCAA channel just to be really frank with you guys. So if you guys came here for that, trust me, it will be here. But is it gonna be the first front of my mind or a priority? Probably not. But I do enjoy making franchise modes and playing it for all YouTube because I do it. For, I do it in my free time. It's so fun. So trust me, we're not going to. We ain't going too far from it. Voice one. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. It was voice two. A few cobwebs and some dust. Oh yeah, now we go. I am back. indeed a student, but it was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Oh, a few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Okay, I like that. We rock that. Name. Let's see. Name. My name is gonna be Gladius. Gladius. Sugarfoot. And we gonna be in the Wizard Dormitory. Fuck you, Tyler. Let's do it. On cutscenes, I'm I'm on unmute when I got my you know reactions and stuff. So let's go ahead and jump right ah, in. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages Not at since all, I've been sir. to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. I know that she's looking around. Let's not talk here. I just... Alright, going back here. Well, now nah, I think it's. But yeah, God, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna tell y'all something. So, we could hear part of her since like the first, movie, the first movie. Now, I always do this, granted, I'm saying I'm gonna be here about it. I think the first movie is supposed to come then start trying to sleep. So I always do this, bear with me. But when I tell y'all I play Chamber of Secrets and Social Strong video game when I was little, and you know, I wish one had Quidditch, like the Quidditch mission on there, bro, like, I always feel like they need to be a, a, a Harry Potter RPG game. It's just like, yeah, it's like, like, I mean, caught you before you left for Scotland. Going away. <laughs> just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. 
Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. What the and fuck was that? It was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard! How did you- Wait! We do- Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Oh, George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. Frames but stay just close. A bit, but I mean. We've no idea who created this port key. I ain't tripping. Or why? Early is early, early. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's a bit choppy. Just, just a tad. I walk around, see what's going on around here, and just vibe. It don't look like this shit ain't really touched really, so I'm just going to follow the story. I'm sorry, I got my one. Oh, by the way, I love, I do, I am a Harry Potter fan, like I said. So I got the Harry Potter fan club app, and I am. Well, I'm not going to reveal my house. But I do have my one. How far did that poor key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. 
The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This game. This Very has not cute. been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Oh, yes, sir. Gladius Sugarfoot should be behind you, sir. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Let's Hogwarts Castle was built by and oh, is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is so that ice? I was it's not cold thinking, enough here. Thinking. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Basic chaos, new spell on the Excellent! Oh, I already got the stick work. I'm gonna say, come on. Slide down that bad boy. But I think this I guess the game that don't have was a bit uh, rougher anything than I expected. To do with, like Harry Potter timeline. I think they said this this part was the I guess you know, Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. I ain't gonna stop breaking stuff. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna check out that video. Ah, up there. I got a double jump or something? Why ain't we doing what I wanted to do? Hello, We're close girl. now. Nasty, it's just bro. ahead. I can see it already. But this game is rather beautiful. Bro. It put me in a mindset of like Elder Ring when I first loaded it. Up, like, Steady yourself! I got that on my Repair seat. Bro. They valued their privacy. That poor key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Alright. Now run. The mini-map shows us surrounding you in the middle. They're really making me hold it. Professor. This statue. This may have been his home. Ain't nothing out there. I don't want to run out there no reason. 
Y'all been here on any other game. I know I'm a collectible whore, so I like to hoard shit a lot. So. Especially when it comes to like progressing through the game, I wanna like I play on a harder difficulty, so I be wanting to grab everything that's in my face because I know resources is hard to come by in some of these games. And I don't just want to expect, you know what I'm saying? This game is good at resources. Some mural of some kind. But I have heard some good things mm. about the game's resources. Perhaps our like host was a noted seer. I, uh, seen and, uh, read Interesting. Like, I like collecting on games. I mean, a lot of people don't really care for those because you know, you gotta collect shit. But I like it. I mean, that's that, that's that's a good thing for me. I I, I prefer to be able to think out the game and grab shit I need for the future or what I could use right now. I didn't know I could. Use. You know what I'm saying? That's it. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Am I seeing myself in it, John? Where's Professor Fig? Oh, okay. Hey, that joke cares, far? How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Mm, so he can't see. What in Merlin's name? Wait, the god. Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Oh shit. We hit the, the daddy horse this place called. This is what they, they ask where they want to go when they tell you. Hello? The bank. There we go. Freaking bank. Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, <where> we <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Hmm. Your wife's porky. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. Well, I'm gonna go with it, lady. After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> Vault number. Vault twelve. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Hey, I knew I wasn't tripping when I saw uh, his R band Here going too. I did see that, Jack. 
Yeah. But I ain't gonna lie, y'all so mesmerized, so I'm when sorry about talking about it. When was the last time this fort was accessed? But I also a goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. I wonder what year is this? Thank you for your help. Excuse me. Excuse me, young chap. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Back. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Oh, wow. Steady your wand with the left stick and guide it to the... No, it's not. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, okay, so I... Okay. Um, shit. Okay, hold on. Um. Um. Yeah, okay. So that is. That's kind of dope. Revelio. There. I saw something. Move a bit all. closer and try again. I mean, I get it. Really? There's a... Appreciate those. A door. Well, that's a start. What's There's that symbol again. Ah, oh, I missed that one. I don't suppose you see a way to... Oh, I do, Professor. Like that symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Well, move out the dead dog on way. Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Okay, that means it's... I hope... I hope uh, it ain't one of them scenes where I, we walk and fail to take... Okay, yeah. I said, I said, can we run and make it past them? I see something up ahead. What is it? That Let's glow see. again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have right. caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. Revelio. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Uh, I'm gonna teach me how to do it, Blade. Let's go. Bang. Bang. I saw I said, teach me that bad boy, Lumos. T first Y. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. That probably was the easiest place to go. Wow, well, that. Look out! Oh, potato. potato. Shit. Akio! Let me 
Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? I guess it's showing me that. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Okay. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Lumos. No, 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 no. Have a take Rebellion. Yeah. I suppose I'm on my own this time. align these statues with their reflections. Then I do it fast enough? Open that. Fifty gold, I guess. Any more? 
more gold, goddamn. Some more chests. Yup, I said, I said, I know there's another chest here somewhere. Revelio. This will. Yep, go right here. I think I'm gonna dry it up on my ass. Yeah. Uh, there you are. How did you? What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive. For viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. Are they live with this? All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded the air. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, Died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We will. It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. I have no patience for traitors. Shit. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful.
Find sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Jealous. Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Is that... Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were... complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. Let no me, time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. So he is! He is the great-great-great-grandfather! That's fucking crazy! Professor Weasley! We've one more to be sorted. Professor Weasley. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Is that Ron's great grandmother? Oh, such a boy. Hey, we know we go. We go. We know. We know where we go. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Oh, what's okay? What's going on? Can we just start class? Can we, go on, I'm looking school. forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed, much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. You know what I'm saying? Big Slytherin, you know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Big Slytherin, you know what I'm saying? Big S out here, you know what I'm talking about. Gonna sell my cuisine. 
know what I'm saying? The sort who makes an entrance. Your boy got a cheat. You, you know belong in Slytherin. Yeah, slither me out, slither me out, you feel me? Yeah. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Wow. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but... Don't tempt me. You are here wow. to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Wow. So they kind of just went ahead and did that in the book. Look, quit as your DLC. Shut it's the fuck up for the you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. So how did the Weasleys fall so far from Grace? Like, you went from being like... Deputy head it's quite professor? uncommon for a student so to like, begin as a hope damn, bro. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Oh, the Slytherin door. <laughs> that was cold. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. I want to keep playing. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. It's like number 48, 9, 50 minutes in. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. can't talk about it. can't talk about I suppose some introductions are in order. Introduce, introduce yourself to Imelda. Ominous. Oh, I should be. Yeah, yeah, it's been Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Oh, hey, what book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks okay 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 what you mean though young guy what you mean what you mean are by you that? saying some spells aren't taught at hogwarts which ones seems i may have met a kindred spirit <laughs> that is a conversation for another time you had good no emotion you. in that last good luck today well sir huh, huh. Uh, all right sebastian what up? first impressions 
and you give me a vibes. See what Amelda is now. What's up, Amelda? If I think you do a, that, yeah, you'll lose. Reyes. Trust me. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Duh. Check me. Told you. Duh. She told you. Woman's intuition. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. Who you, You're the new I? Slytherin, the one uh, who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Uh, 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 Interesting uh, uh, tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. Uh, nah, we we, we have rock that one. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Okay, okay, okay. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. All right, all right, all right, all right. Talk to Ominous. Are you in the quarter like you, uh, what's, what's that boy name? I, I think what's I that, heard that boy one. Name? What is that boy? Malfoy. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Draco. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Are you blind? Is he blind? I'd much rather have arrived on time and without a dragon attack en route. I'm sure. How horrible. Is he... I can only imagine. He blind, is he? Well, it's good to have you in Slytherin. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Okay, nice meeting you, boy. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. All right, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Why'd you just walk in here so I'm gonna get a run down? Serious black great granddaddy is in this joint. Ron Weasley's great grandmother is in this joint. Uh, she's Professor Serious Black. Great great grandfather used to be the headmaster of Hogwarts. Thanks. Uh,. What else happened? Nothing really too crazy. Uh, that little midget gnome thingy. What are these? Troll? What do they call them? Trolls? Not trolls. Goblins. I couldn't remember if it, I couldn't remember what it was called. It was I forgot tr it, it, a word. Cause they they got the same face as trolls, but trolls are obviously bigger. So I, mean, I couldn't remember if it was a troll. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? Yeah, but I've Red been dreaming Rock of this day for a long time. Try to blow Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us this as a year, you'll need to catch well, up reason. with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Now, My name is Gladys. Yes, your ordinary Gladys wizarding level exam. Sugarfoot. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. 
After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? House chest. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be able to see surroundings. Yeah, I mean, moving like my glasses. I said I'm in Hogwarts and we walking with Professor Weasley. God damn. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. I trust me. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the field Revelio. guide can provide? Revelio. Why well, can't I open it? Ah, he wanted them chests. I can't be seen while trying to open him. Oh, that's pretty nice. Revelio. This is your wizard of XP earned from challenges, creature your level and power. Click to your first guide page, unlock a new challenge category, new challenge to unlock your guys' picture. <sighs> we'll appear here, here. Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts. Collect one or two guide pages in Hogwarts. Gear appearance reward. Oh, so I unlock, I unlock clothes and stuff. Okay, that's cool. Basically, accessories, cosmetics, and Okay, well, that's pretty, that's pretty dope. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. In. Mm, okay. Ascendo. Cofringo. Espeliabas! Avada Kedavra. And outside of the castle. Hey, that's cool. They got all these spells in here. <laughs> that's so live, bro. That's just so live. Alright, we'll be going there, shall we? Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains Ooh. a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. These stairs lead to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. You can get anywhere in the castle from Central Hall. What's up, Marky? That's just love it. Always something happening here. <laughs> it's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross oh, Station, so to speak. My family jumped. That should be beautiful. all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Um. 
Hogsmeade was Hogsmeade. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Hogsmeade, Professor. You know. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Oh, butterbeer? They even got butterbeer in the game. I know we gotta pull up a drink, drink that butter. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival. I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. 
I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Well, I just realized I did all that shit. I don't know when I turned off my sound. So, I'm glad, fortunately, that I can just edit to show y'all what I did and get to here. So, hey, good for you. So glad I can edit stuff now. Levioso! Now, As a matter of fact, let's I try something a little audio larger. About me talking about the game. Look, I'm not trying to make this series look like I just don't give a shit. I, this game, I'm finna give a fuck. This series, I'm finna give a fuck. Like, Y'all gonna see editing skills I didn't even know I had. Let us begin with the basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. So Remember, a surprised opponent. Good. Now, well done. I can't wait to have another. Very window. good. I think that but be the best way to practice is by this dueling. Is we'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Leviosa, nigga basic cast, and <laughs> Protego. You may begin. Hi, right, Draco. Leviosa, Protego. Lucky. Nothing lucky about this. Good form. I know. Oh, you go. Protego. Leviosa. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> That's why I ain't got slid on the cover. You know what I'm saying? I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different game.
kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Bitch, you ain't got one right now. Oh, like right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is just... If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way. Nice work. Revelio. Strong, I gotta beat up in this door. Level 11? What's what level 11 is? Level 11 is just supposed to be like that, that level or something. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Mm -hmm. Exclusive and unsanctioned. What are we talking here? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Well, I know it's funny. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I I'll see you soon. They Perhaps reference. somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if Harry your performance Potter today was sheer secrets. luck or actual skill. Mission, Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. I if think you're that interested. was a reference to that. Till next this time. gotta be clever enough. Nah, that shit was hard. Hard. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. <laughs> Akio. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. 
Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! Fast up along the way. Ah. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> 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 so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Huh? 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 <laughs> okay. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last Accio moment. Now, excellent control there. Who oh, even if it? Splendid! Very good! One bit. What else you need to do, Tink? Very good! Points to Slytherin! But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up! You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Use that shit on the body, so it's very bad. Lisa! Oh, my God. Oh, there we go. Akio! You don't want fit again. I'm getting that one fit again. You don't want fit. That's it! Let us see this. Who that one fit again? Akio. Ooh, that hoe went over the. Oh, that hoe went over the jet. Oh, damn. Talking all that shit. Damn it. Don't lose your composure. Oh, what? Yeah. Thought I get talking that cash money. She screwed the dub. Oh my, she screwed the That is how it's done. I'ma be down a hundred. I'ma be down. You okay, baby? I'ma be down a hundred. Brilliant. Damn. 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 Rematch, honky. Damn. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Okay, okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Okay, okay, I like that. I'll this. say. Hey, enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Okay, so what? Yes! Akio! Mm, too hard. Stay focused! Let us see this. Akio. Excellent control there. Here we go. That Man, is how it's she, done. This ugly. She be current. She be she current. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, that 
That was an execution. Let's go. Let's go. I should have seen it. They just got knocked off and fought with me. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Oh, nice and conversation. Of course. Or Wagadu. Can can a word Akio if you would. I promise I would have been able to get If you're so right. inclined. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Hmm. Rebellion. Sneak and snatch. I can't wait to to learn the pig locks. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to Sorry, my charms like homework. Boy, I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Oh, okay, that was just an extra conversation. So, I wonder, I ain't gonna lie, with these extra conversations do they like play a factor in the story, like, so, so quest is not available, they will say quest is not available, okay, key, key, uh, 
right, so I have actually two hours of footage. Probably knocking down maybe like the hour 15 because I had to edit that whole time without sound. Um, just to see what we got in collections to see. I thought we did a couple things. it right here this is the end of the video i appreciate you guys stopping by man it is a little late i thought i was gonna record another game but nah we're gonna keep it at that 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 yeah so get what you guys <laughs> get what you guys <laughs> until next time your boy is out